Hi, I'm Riley. And I'm with Francis and Harper. And we are going to be doing NBA predictions by with play by play. So, um, who do y'all think is going to be in the finals? Um, well, it's early to predict, obviously. It's just two months after the season. But, um, yeah, look at the Denver Nuggets coming out of the West, possibly. But you could also look at the Phoenix Suns. But the problem is they have no bench. Obviously, Golden State's there. The LA's there. But in the East, I probably got the Celtics or Miami or uh, Boston coming out. Who do you think is going to be Francis? Well, it's very early to say because, you know, there's a lot of trade rumors going on. Like, Damian Lillard might go to the Heat, which make them a really good contender. you got the Lakers, obviously, with LeBron James and AD. LeBron's still going strong in year 21. Obviously, the Nuggets in back to coming off the championship. They can try to go for back-to-back. It looks like no team's going to beat them. The Boston Celtics, obviously, Eastern Conference champion, almost Eastern Conference champions. But it's going to be really hard to decide. I mean, honestly, my early predictions, I might just go with the Nuggets. <clears throat> And uh, whoa, 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 breaking news. The Hawks have traded their star point guard, Trey Young, for John Morant. This is a blockbuster deal. Two very good point guards. The Hawks getting John Morant back. And Trey Young, shockingly, is leaving the Atlanta Hawks, which people have rumored, and I guess the rumors are true. What do you think about this, Francis? Well, honestly, I don't think it's a good trade. I mean, John Morant's already not been in a great situation with uh, Memphis. You know, the situation he's been around, the environment over there has led him to some really bad things. And I, I don't anything against Atlanta, but, I mean, the atmosphere in Atlanta isn't much better than it is in Memphis. And, you know, John Morant also 25 games suspension. He's not going to play for the first few games. So we don't know how good that's going to be. And we don't know how good John Morant's playmaking will be with Cook Capella and, you know, DeJounte Murray. So I personally don't think it's a good trade all around. So what do you think about Harper? Uh, I think this is a good trade for the Memphis Grizzlies, but a horrendous trade for the Atlanta Hawks. Personally, I mean, you're giving up Trey Young, who's average is 30 and 10 a game. I mean, John Morant's a great player, but then look at the problems he's going to cause. Plus, he shoots, well, I think, like 30 some percent from three, and you're giving up Trey, and you're tra- giving him, and you're trading uh, Trey Young for him. I don't think I don't like this trade at all. So the Hawks' starting five now is John Morant, Dejounte Murray, DeAndre Hunter. Uh, Whoever their power forward is after trading John Collins and Clint Capella, with John, with um, the Grizzlies starting five being Trey Young, Desmond Bain, whoever their small forward and power forward are, and Marcus then Smart, uh, Marcus, Steven Adams. Mm-hmm. and then their sender is um, Stephen Adams, and their power forward is going to be Jaron Jackson. Uh, we're play by play, and thank you for watching.